and we are assured of God's faithfulness. Here we receive God's promise of eternal life. I invite you parents and sponsors. We invite Logan to join us on the journey of faith presented for baptism. As baptized believers, we claim Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior. Living together in trust and hope, let us join to together as we confess our, words, our faith in the words of the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, He rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Congregation, you may be seated. Steph and Josh, parents in Christian love, we bring Logan to be baptized today. It is the first step on his faith journey, and it signifies your desire to pass on faith to him. To help make this happen, it is your responsibility to take him to church, to pray with him, to teach him right and wrong, starting with the Ten Commandments, to make time for regular family devotions, to teach him to share, and to set a good example of what it means to be a disciple of Jesus. Do you promise to do these things with the best of your ability? If so, please respond. We do with God's help. And Chris, Joanna, and Justin, it is your role to encourage Logan to walk with God, to pray for him, to support him as he grows in faith. You promise to do these things to the best of your ability. If so, please respond. We do with God's help. We do with God's help. And people of Christ the King, as God's family in this place, it is our privilege to care for each other and to bear one another's burdens. God offers us fellowship, hospitality, and help to those in need. When we do, we are reminded of the amazing grace God shows us through His Son, Jesus Christ. Do you promise to pray for Logan, welcome him into this church, and teach him about God's love? If so, please respond, we do with joy. We do with joy. Come on over, Logan. I a big yarn today. Logan J., I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs> Logan, God created you with a plan for your life and will serve the word, and you will serve the world and please him. As you grow in faith, may God bless you with wisdom, strength, and peace. Logan, child of God, you have been sealed by the Holy Spirit and marked with the cross of Christ forever. You missed it. There was a big smile in your <laughs> And like the flame of this candle brings light into the darkness, Logan, let God's light shine brightly in all that you do, that you may give glory to your Father in heaven. He is so happy right now. <laughs> let us pray together. Gracious God, in goodness and love, you forever bring forth new life. We give thanks that you've given new life to Logan through the sacrament. Watch over him as he grows in years and in faith. Guide him as he faces life's choices. Surround him with a church family that will support him and affirm his gifts. Remind him daily that he is precious in your sight, a valuable and loved child of God. In your holy name we pray. Amen. Come on over, Logan. Look at this little guy. We are so excited to introduce you to Logan Jay, our newest member of Christ the King and our new brother in Christ. We give thanks for him and for all that he is and all that he will become. Let's join in welcoming him by singing Jesus Loves Me. Amen. 